good morning everyone um so today is my birthday um we've got a bit of a trip planned out to go to london today so i thought i'd take you along with me um we're well i'm <laughs> buying um a special little bag i don't know what bag yeah that's the surprise running a bit behind this morning because i decided to do eyeliner for the first time in um a year so <laughs> Uh, rooms estate um, but if you're interested in coming along with me for my birthday then stay tuned also guys if you're new here don't forget to hit that red subscribe button i don't know where my cushion is my cushion's not here um don't forget to subscribe um like and also leave me a little comment i'm wearing that collusion dress that we all know and love and of course we had to take the little classic chanel out for the second time ever um so yeah i'm really looking forward to today um i think it's going to be a really great day the car in the park tower car park and that's where we normally park now in london it's very convenient and now we're just oh, outside harvey nichols waiting for an uber dad sat on a step down the road <laughs> resting <laughs> um and uh they've got really good toilets <laughs> in harvey nichols that, oh that, um <laughs> Are very convenient because the park tower won't let us use their toilets as we are not residents so uh -huh. maybe next year <laughs> <laughs> um, but it's quite a muggy day it's quite warm but it's also very cloudy um, and we're a little bit late on the schedule but we should make up time got to keep the schedule to keep the schedule <laughs> Chanel checkers board. Don't know how much that is, but probably quite a bit. And I want all the handbags. <laughs> So just finished up in Chanel and our um, sales associate told us about a bank sea. Um, it was really close by, literally behind Chanel. Um, so yeah, let me just show you this little secret Chanel, oh, secret Chanel, secret Banksy. Um, very, I had no idea it was even here. Um, here's mum. Oh, I can't, I'll show you mum taking a picture of it now. <laughs> Here she is, taking a picture of the Banksy. So there it is. Very meaningful, especially after you've just spent a billion pounds in Chanel. So we've just got a black cab. Um, Dad's moaning, saying the restaurant doesn't look fancy enough. But we think it looks nice, don't we, Mum? We do, and I just think sometimes 
fancy? What does fancy mean? We just love the food and... So I'm going to show you what it looks like now. So this is Harry's, it's right behind Harrods. Really, really nice Italian food, you can stay outside. But I think we've got a table booked inside, so let's go. So we're a bit early, we're gonna go see if our table's ready now. Yummy. Luca. Luca. Luca's Luca is making now. my cocktail. <laughs> The Coco Bello. Coco Bello. <laughs> it is a vodka, pineapple juice, amaretto, coconut sperm. Oh, oh no, I didn't. I want to watch that cocktail be made. <laughs> Ah. You can always go over. Oh, does that happen? <laughs> Maybe not. You know where that is? Eight miles away. That cost me a bit of money. Yeah, then you can Ooh. Drink. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. You got some squirty cream. <laughs> wow. Coconut cream. Oh. Coconut foam. Beautiful! Oh, more! <gasps> Flowers! Oh, beautiful. So cute. Gorgeous. Oh, wow. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Um, so here is the veal milanese. I like, I like this one. Dance lemon soul. Look how cute the plate is, Harry's. We've got mashed potatoes, clams, clams. We've got broccoli, <laughs> mum got the steak, With, without a horseradish, she's absolutely devastated. Mum got some chippies. Oh my gosh, Dad's already started. So here is the classic um, Harry's toadstool. How cute is that? How cute is it, Mum? It's very cute. It's got a lovely pistachio sauce on there. Oh my gosh, just had a happy birthday, and here is my amazing Sunday. From London um, after lunch we went to Harrods and I didn't film anything <laughs> um, just because it's quite busy wasn't it mum was. um, so they've now got the Kylie cosmetics in Harrods but they had like hardly anything left um, I did want some specific shades but she, literally the girl was like there's nothing left um, so, but I did still manage to pick up four things. So I thought in this video, let me show you what I got from Kylie. And then I think I will share in another video what I picked up from Chanel. <laughs> um, you're currently in a kitchen cabinet right now. That's what this is. Um, so first up, I got the Kirsten. Um, here we are. Kirsten. Uh, lip kit. This is apparently a Harrods exclusive. They had four lip kits left, four different shades left, and they were like pink, <laughs> like hot pink, um, like no niche. Basically, they said they only had like two of a lot of things come in. Um, so this is the shade I got. It was super, super pretty. I really wanted Coco K though. Um, she let me try it on. And I was just like, damn, that makes me want it even more. Um, so yeah, also insider knowledge. Um, apparently it's coming to Boots in October. Um, so I think that'll be great because we could all get it then and get points. Um, then... I got the Ice Me Out highlighter. I wasn't originally going to get a highlighter, but I swatched it 
and it was actually really pretty Ooh. this is what it looks like and it's got like Kylie embossed all over it this was 25 pounds which is a pound less than the lip kit but obviously you get two items in the lip kit so in my eyes this is probably the most expensive thing but it does feel really really nice very like buttery soft and a bit a bit more subtle um, than my regular highlights so I think this is going to be like a good day-to-day -day highlight and they had quite a few shades that I think suited quite fair skin tones so if you're fair like me check out these <laughs> then I got another powder product I got kitten baby which is a blush the bronzers all looked really really dark and powdery and I did notice they had a lot of the bronzers left a lot, a lot of oh my god my dress is just falling off my body um and a lot of the brow stuff left because like I said like I'm not I just like the elf three pound pencil um so I was like I'm not really interested in that <laughs> uh so yeah but if you are interested in brows they still had some and um, this is the blush color i got again it was super limited and i didn't have the first choices that i wanted but i really like the shade again really good shades for fairer complexions um obviously though not great if you've got deeper complexion i feel like they didn't have that many deep shade options but i imagine they'll be kind of adding more to the line as they go and then finally i got the kai liner and um, so basically i just had to do eyeliner today for the first time in a year and all my eyeliners were like dried up um and i've heard really good things about this um so i was just like you know what I'll just treat myself um and it's cute little pink packaging um, i think it's like a brush tip rather than like felt which is also really good really like that and she literally gave me so many samples of the the face moisturizer, like a whole week, a whole week's worth. I didn't pick up any skincare because I'm not really sure on it. But this will be a good test. But I kind of feel like it's very overpriced for what the ingredients are. I think you're you are you are paying for the brand, like you are with the makeup. But I think color cosmetics are a bit different than skincare um we were served by a girl called felicity and she was absolutely amazing so if you go to harrods and go to the kylie shop try and speak to felicity because she was so nice and um yeah she was really nice to my dad <laughs> let him sit down for half an hour <laughs> um but yeah I had a brilliant day thank you so much for all of your messages on instagram um i do i was like reading them all like throughout the day but i couldn't reply to everyone's just because um yeah it's been a bit of a crazy day and i'm actually really really tired um we have picked up some cake from the food court so really looking forward to having that tonight whilst watching love island because that's what we're gonna do we're mm. gonna watch un it's un not un after sun mm. gonna go watch after sun now because we didn't watch that last night because we had to get up really early this morning so we, we're gonna watch that now and then we're gonna watch this is just the best and casa amore is happening tonight on my birthday what more can a girl ask for um so i possibly will be doing a video with all my chanel goodies if that interests you guys let me know in the comments if that would be something you would like to see um i don't do luxury goods a lot of my channel because i can't buy them often <laughs> um but let me know if that's something you would love to see it was such an amazing experience today um i'd love to tell you more about it in another video but yeah it's been a great day thanks mum and dad for taking me up there <laughs> and buying well, me lunch yeah mum did all the driving <laughs> um she's very she's getting very good at that now Cheeky! I've always been very good. Yeah, but like, even better, <laughs> so you can do it more often. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for all the comments, uh, messages, all the love um, on IG. Really appreciate it. I'm really tired, guys, so I am going to go. Um, so yeah, hope you enjoyed it. A very short but sweet little birthday vlog. Um, 
wasn't the well i'm not the greatest vlogger in the world i still need to like practice but yeah i hope you enjoyed it still and i'll leave all the information down below of like the the restaurants and stuff that we went to and also where we park it's a very convenient location um so yeah hope you're all staying safe and well and i'll catch you later bye